Hello, my name is Logan Brewster, and this is my four minute video uh, for the video prompt for Spanish 160. And I chose prompt two. Uh, the first question states, find one or two characters from the film with whom you identify and select the pros and cons and having them represent the idea of popular culture and, and an imagined community. Uh, the two characters I chose were David and Diego. Uh, David was the straight uh, male who was a student, and he was a uh, enlightened young communist. And then the second was Diego, and he was the homosexual character who was trying to befriend uh, David throughout the movie. And he was a Cuban nationalist because the movie took place um, in Cuba. And I don't really necessarily relate um, too strongly to uh, either specifically, but I think that everyone nowadays, no matter where you are uh, living or your political beliefs or whatever it may be, uh, we can all understand the feeling of having differences in opinions, and especially now more today than ever. Um, and those two opinions are obviously conflicting at the time uh, when the film is taking place, but they're still friends. They have their battles and struggles um, like any friends do. And I think, like I said, now more today than ever, we can all uh, agree to disagree on most things with how politicized um, everything has become. Um, so that would be kind of my main takeaway from those uh, two characters. And then uh, the next question was, why do you identify with these characters? Please do not just say, because I like them. Give me a substance answer. Uh, yeah, I think I, um, out of the two, I would probably have to say David. Um, he was much more like tied, I guess you could say, to his morals. Um, more than Diego, uh, that's probably why I would choose David. Um, the next question states, describe what is the role that the character Diego in the movie plays in a socialist society such as Cuba? Uh, well, I mean, given that he's a Cuban nationalist, I think it's like he plays an important role in Cuba because he's trying to keep the original, uh, like, traditions, I guess you could say, there in Cuba, and he doesn't want the government or uh, politics to necessarily change. Um, and that's where I think uh, when David comes in, they have conversations about politics and art and social issues and everything that's going on in Cuba. And that's where I think everyone today can relate uh, to both characters that there's never going to be one person that you fully agree with and i think that's a good thing and i think the movie portrayed like a very good like they didn't they were civil throughout most of the uh, movie and that's good i don't think we have that enough today uh yeah i know i keep going back to that point i just think it's really important that both sides are less polarized everywhere uh, today throughout the world and we all need to have more civil and normal conversations um so it's not so violent and ruthless so the, those are the main things that i took away but specifically that question i think it's important for cuba that there is a character like diego to show that cuba like they want to be strong and independent in their own country thank you